In today's video, I will teach you how to flag photos and manage flagged photos in Lightroom. Let's get started. Flagging photos in Lightroom is a great way to quickly organize and manage your photo selections. First, launch Lightroom and go to the Library or Develop module. Then navigate to the folder or collection containing the photos that you want to flag. There are three flagging options. The first one is picking a flag, which is also marking as a favorite. To do this, select a photo, then press P on your keyboard. And alternatively, you can click the flag icon at the bottom of the thumbnail or go to Photo, then set Flag to select Flagged. You can also reject flag or mark for deletion or review. To do this, you can press X on your keyboard to mark the photo as rejected. You can also use the flag icon or go to Photo, set Flag, then select Rejected. And to unflag a photo, press U to remove a flag from a photo, or go to Photo, set Flag, then select the unflagged option. And here's how to filter by flags. At the bottom of the Lightroom interface, you can use the filter bar to filter photos by their flag status. Flag shows only photos marked as favorites. Rejected shows photos marked for review or deletion. And unflag displays photos without any flag status. After filtering, you can review the flagged photos more easily in the grid view or loop view. And to delete rejected photos, you can filter by rejected photos using the filter bar. Then press Ctrl and Backspace or Command Delete on Mac to bring up the delete dialog. Then choose whether to remove or delete from Lightroom or delete from disk which removes the photo from Lightroom and delete the file from your computer. You can organize the flagged photos into a collection for easier access and management. And to do this, select the flagged photos, then right click and choose Create Collection or drag the photos into an existing collection in the Collections panel. Flagging photos in Lightroom is an essential tool for photographers to streamline their workflow, quickly sort through large photo collections, and manage the selections efficiently. And you're done! If you find this video helpful, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. And if you want to see more tutorials, turn on the notification bell to get notified whenever we upload new videos.